What's going on YouTube? Ray from Philly here on this Friday, July the 12th, 2019. I'm excited today because today was my last day of work before I start my vacation, so I'm officially on vacation. But it's Friday Night Vintage. It's a biggie. Hope you're tuning in for this. This is a card for my number one set registry. You know it, the 300 great baseball cards of the 20th century by Mr. Mike Payne. This card here is my 173rd uh, card for this set. So just moving right along here, but I didn't get this card from eBay. I got this card from my LCS. I worked hard to get this card. I put it on layaway. Not ashamed to admit it. So I paid for it weekly on this card and paid it off recently and can't wait to show you the, you guys this card. This is uh, my 173rd card. It's of, you see I'm donning the uniform of the 57 old Milwaukee Braves. Here is the 56 tops Hank Aaron and a PSA 5. Of course, I'll give you guys a closer look. I'll flip the phone around. There's the front. There's the back. Right over here at the back. I love the cartoons on the back. This card looks exceptionally well. Good grade on this card. Did cost a pretty penny on this, but you know, like I said, I was fortunate enough to have an LCS that I can work a layaway program with. So I'm going to flip the phone around, give you guys the excerpt from the book. Really excited to add this card. This is a biggie off of the list. So hope you guys are enjoying uh, the, this, the weekend now. So hope you have a great weekend. So hold on, give you guys a closer look. Okay, and here it is. I can't use the uh, PSA stand because this is a panoramic view of this card. And man, this card really, really looks awesome. The centering is fantastic on it. And if you guys don't know the story of this card, who is that sliding into home plate? Well, yes, it's Willie Mays. Or so the rumor has it, but I'm pretty sure it's true. Everybody's been talking about that saying right there. Uh, and also, here's the back of the card. Looks great. And in case you guys haven't noticed, on this particular card, the picture of Hank Aaron right there is the same picture that's being used on his 54 tops rookie, his 55 tops, and in the 56 tops. So they've used the same picture on all of his first three cards. And then let's get to the book right here. Really excited to add this card. This is a one-of-a-kind card that's biggie for me to get. Uh, let's actually take a look what I need here. I don't have the Mantle or the Kofax, but I do have the Killebrew. I do have that Clemente. This is actually on my radar next. The 1956 Tops Hank Aaron card number 31. Call this two superstars for the price of one. While that definitely is Henry Aaron in the big photo, the same picture used on his 54 and 55 Tops cards, by the way, that's not Aaron sliding into home. That's actually another pretty fair ball player, Willie Mays. Yes, that's a Milwaukee uniform the sliding player has on, but it was printed, painted on by the artist. That photo of Mays sliding actually appeared in a baseball publication a year before appearing on Hank Aaron's baseball card. So there you have it. Mike Payne said it was in there That's as Willie Mays, and so it has been told. It is Willie Mays. And I'm really, really, again, ex ex just ecstatic to add this card. Really, really, is one of my bigger ones of the year. Take another closer look at it. It's just the artwork in 56 Tops, and I'm going to use this word. This is an iconic set, the 56 Top set. And there's a gray back, and there's another color back. I forgot what it is, but um, PSA 5. It's just a sharp-looking card. Great shape. And there you have it. So I appreciate all your likes and comments, guys. Thanks for tuning in. I'll be back again a lot in the next several days while I'm off doing a lot of content. So remember to keep loving the hobby, keep on collecting, and make sure, like I've always said, have fun with it. See you guys again tomorrow night. Take care.